Hello everybody, welcome back to another video, and today I got my hands on the Giganotosaurus. I'm not sponsored by Mattel, even though you said by Mattel box. It's Amazon, I can prove it because of those tape. Now as I was saying, today I bought this figure. Well technically, I bought it on Black Friday for like a cheaper price, and I got my hands on the Giganotosaurus. I'm going to explain the story why I did not get the Battle Combat stuff exclusive at Target. Anyways, let's let's get her op let's get this Giganotosaurus open. I don't even know if it's a girl or a boy. I think it's a boy. Oh crap! Here we go. Okay. Let's see. I'll be right back with you guys. All right. I open her. All right. Go over to see her. There we go, that's one side, just the other side. Oh, that's weird. Oh, Alright, yeah, let's get her out. Come on, give me the key. No, no, sorry. Alright, give me a sec. Alright. Holy moly, that's a beauty right there. Here's the Giganotosaurus. Let's go. Get, get Giganotosaurus out. Oh, there we go. Whoa, this thing's a crazy monster. Awesome dinosaur. Look at this. Look at this nice detail. Reminds me when I first saw it at Target. Go check out my Target video when I found this guy. I also bought the Paleosaurus, but it, it, it seems that I guess it did, I guess he didn't came today. So I'm assuming Impaleo will be coming tomorrow on Wednesday. Because originally it was going to be a vi video about these two, but I guess we're not. I guess we're just doing Giga Dinosaurs today. So here's the Giga in all of its glory. Because the tail can move. That's cool. Here's the scan code if you want to scan it. Pause the video. And of course, it has two buttons. The first button up here. Awesome. And then we have the second button under the button under. Here. This is probably my favorite button. That one kind of gives me uh, goosebumps, and that also reminds me of the Indominus Rex. Okay, I guess it doesn't have that much for ours. Anyways, let's take a look at the back of the box. We can see we have the Giganotosaurus with that dino right there, the Rogue of Primus. I need to get that one really bad. And then we have, of course, the T-Rex and the Therodinosaurus, the one that I already have my hands on. Anyways, let's get this girl open. Of course, this should be really easy since I can just... But then I realized that I forgot about the feet. Luckily, there is this hiding. I feel so bad to destroying this box. I love this box. Rest in peace box. Okay, this box is harder than I thought with just one hand. Okay, Screw it. I'm just going to use the scissors. There. Now it's easy. Okay, never mind. Okay. But I think I got it. <sighs> Damn, that was hard. Alright. Yep, there we go. Alright. So. There's one. And then there's the second one. 
Oh, that hurts so bad at opening the box. Number two. Come on. There we go. We got the Giga. Rest in peace, Giga box. From 2022 to 2022. Now, okay, I'm gonna get things cleaned up and then we'll be right back. All right, here's the Gorg Giga Dinosaurs. You can move the tail. It's pretty cool. Or I guess when you're like playing, you can like pose it, I guess, which is pretty cool about that part. Um, I didn't understand why they had this part, but I mean, it's not a... It's not a bad thing about it, but it's, it's kind of really cool. I'm not gonna lie, it's pretty cool. And I heard people were having problems with the, this figure because of the... The, this problem. Not this problem. This problem is cool. This this part is cool, but it's kind of this problem. Basically, they want to get like this, like half of this body, like straightened, like for this part, because Giga like meant to be like straightened. But like, yeah, I also saw somebody like like remodeled, like kind of fixed this figure, and like they go the raw, like the raw right now, and like is like able to like get this straight. But he had to like break the figure, so yeah. Anyways, here's the Giga. The Giga feel like pretty badass. Same for the claws. You can't you can only move them, but you can't like size them like the Allosaurus. Check that video out. We got some white paint here. I don't even know if that's a mistake. Or oh, that's what it just looks like. Because we got some white paint over here. I think that's supposed to be like a mistake. The button is squishy. It is soft material. I like the material though. The Giga looks kind of cool next to the tweed though. And the tongue looks like very, like it's very pinkish more to like the other tongues. Uh, this figure is pretty cool. I do like do many things with this figure. Before I compare it with the other figures I have, even the T-Rex and the Theragonosaurus, time for me to explain why I did not buy the Battle Combat set exclusive at Target. Now, the reason why I didn't buy that set is because, basically, it's too expensive. That's probably the first reason why. Even though it went down to 60-something and Black Friday, I still don't want to buy that much money. The, I do want the set for one reason. The Ellie Sander figure. I only want it because of that. Because she's the only character that I am missing. Besides Maisie. Because I am looking for Maisie though too. Because I don't have Maisie with the Lintrosaurs and Beta. I mean I do have Beta. But I don't have the Lintrosaurs or Maisie. That's kind of the reason why I want to get the Maisie pack with Lintrosaurus. Because I like the little Lintrosaurus on it. But yeah basically. Uh. It, yeah, I didn't have enough money for it. Like, can you believe it? The set's like about $129.99 for the set. Like, that's bullshit. Like, who will buy that? I, they only, Mattel only made that because for the money and for other stuff, basically. They like to make an expensive pack for the money at this point. But I don't judge them. To be actually, I do judge them. Um, never mind. I I take that back. I do judge them because they only do it for the money. They don't care about the figures. I think they just want to get the money. Anyways, let's get let's forget about that and let's compare this dinosaur with the other ones. And the human figures are included in this. Let's do. This. All right, I got all the figures. Here's the Alan Grant figure from 2017. Here's the Atrociraptor from the. Extreme Damage series for the Minion series. Here's our old friend the Allosaurus. Check that video out. Here's the Therosinosaurus. One of my favorite figures. 
here is the T-Rex. And of course we have Giganosaurus in the background. You could basically remake the movie, except without some of the human characters. Because I'm literally only missing Maisie and Ellie Sadner. I try to look at eBay to see if they have anything cheap, but it's the same price just for the, the figure though. So yeah. I'm probably going to have to try to save a lot of money, even though may not, it's going to be not worth it. But it's kind of a sacrifice I'm willing to make at this point. So yeah. Basically, do I recommend this figure? I 100% recommend this figure. You need to buy this for your children. Basically. So basically, like... So basically, the T-Rex and the Giga are pretty much the same price. Because... They basically have two features at this point. T-Rex can roar. And then they could like... Move sideways, left and right. Giga, of course, it could has two features. Of course, has the button. Then this, the chomping feature and the rod feature, and then we have the Therosinosaurus. Basically, you just press the button, and then you like the slashing, and then Allosaurus. The, the roaring feature, and then we have the battle damage feature. Oh, let me just get that. Hold up, it's not about Allosaurus. It's about the Giganotosaurus today. Anyways, I recommend this figure. This figure is gonna be about I think thirty six. 99 for now I think if you buy it for like a clearance deal I will probably recommend waiting until it like goes down to like 30 something like 35 because either way that's how much this figure costs at this point because the actual price for this figure is $44.99 yeah anyways thank you guys for watching my video and tomorrow we'll be unboxing the paleo source and unless it comes later on today I think it may come later on today, but, and I'll see you guys next time in another video, and I'll see you guys later on. Later, fans.